We can always understand how heartbreaking it can get when your favorite hero dies in a movie series. Well, diehard Iron Man fans know it better. The character of Tony Stark came to an end in the last Avengers movie. Iron Man. The endgame was emotional in a hundred other ways, but Iron Man dying in the climax scene counts for 99 out of them. As it turns out, the story of Iron Man isn't finished yet. The internet has been flooded with constant speculations about an upcoming Iron Man 4 movie. In this video, we are going to address these speculations and tell you whether the fourth installation of this hit sequence will be released or not. Stick with us till the end to know who could be the new actor playing Tony Stark's as Robert Downey Jr.'s replacement. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, don't forget to hit the date, subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to always stay updated. The character of Tony Stark played by Robert Downey Jr. was one of the central Avengers superheroes created by the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Let's be honest, everybody loved him and wanted to be Tony Stark, at least in one moment in their lives. His story came to a brief ending when his character was killed at the end of Avengers Endgame. It came after Thanos, the villains wiped off 50% of the population and then the superhero found a way to tackle, having Tony Stark at the dying end. Endgame, which was released in 2019, showed how Iron Man sacrificed himself to defeat the villain Thanos and ultimately saves the universe, no matter how difficult it was to accept the audience. Robert Downey Jr. made it pretty clear that he was done playing the Iron Man role. So why did Robert decide to put an end to one of the most iconic characters in Hollywood history? Was he done playing the same repetitive role over and over again? Or did he just believe that Iron Man staying dead would keep his character stay alive in the fans' hearts instead. Here is what he had to say. Out of all superheroes in the Avengers clan, Iron Man is probably the one with the strongest fan base. Along with loving the character, people often gush how perfectly Robert plays his part. Robert Downey Jr. has been playing the role of Tony Stark in the Marvel Cinematic Universe for over a decade now. The man has appeared in about 10 films, including three of his own installations. Apart from the origin of Iron Man introductory movies, he has appeared in the Avengers and Spider-Man Homecoming. But during an interview with Off Camera in 2019, Downey clearly stated that he was done now playing his part as Tony Stark. Jokingly, Robert stated that it is time for Tony Stark to retire and Robert Downey to take over other films too. He even said that he had the most amazing journey of 10 years, playing the part of uh, Tony Stark, which would always remain alive in his heart. Robert revealed that he gave it his all to dig deep just for the people to like him as Iron Man. He went on to explain that he felt that he had accomplished everything that he could with the character and that it was time for him to move on. In the same interview, he stated that people often stereotype one actor when he plays the same character for such a long time. Hence, Robert felt that it was finally the time for him to move on from the Marvel Cinematic Universe and try out different acting challenges. He replied, now that Avengers Endgame was released and well reciprocated by the audience, his part of the job was already done. Robert directed all of his focus to his 2020 film Doolittle. The actor has continued to take on several other projects since he took his exit from the MCU. Even though Robert clarified his take on the matter, fans falsely speculated that Iron Man's character would be made alive in the Spider-Man No Way Home movie. Well, as we all know, Marvel always creates hype and then preserves it for the next installation. The exact thing happened, this time around too, when the Iron Man fans were disappointed to not find Tony Stark in Spider-Man's latest release. Similar thing happened when Doctor Strange, The Multiverse of Madness premiered in the theaters last year. Before we reveal who could probably play the new Tony Stark in its fourth installation, let us first go through a brief, collecting everything that happened earlier. Till now, there are only three films, having Robert Downey Jr. playing the part of Tony Stark as the introductory trilogy. Tony Stark, who is portrayed as a billionaire industrialist and a genius inventor, creates a powerful suit of armor. It had the potential to fight the biggest crimes. The world was introduced with Iron Man for the first time in 2008, when its first film was released. It showed Tony Stark's gradual transformation into Iron Man after he was kidnapped by terrorists. Thus, in this way, he was instigated to create a powerful weapon to fight against injustice. This brilliant inventor uses his engineering skills 
to develop the infamous Iron Man suit. The movie was extremely loved by the audience, and Robert Downey Jr. as Tony Stark was the best part about it. As a result, a huge hype was already created around the second movie of the sequence. Iron Man 2, which was released in 2010, focused on the personal events in Tony Stark's life. Here, the protagonist faces increasing pressure from the U.S. government to hand over his hard work, the Iron Man suit. He also discovers that the palladium in the arc reactor that powers his suit is poisoning him and slowly killing him. As he races to find a cure for his condition, he must also battle a new enemy, Ivan Vanko, who has his own suit of armor and a personal vendetta against the Stark family. The second movie was more serious in terms of events, differentiating itself from the introductory part. The third and the most successful of the Iron Man trilogy was released three years later in 2013. The third movie in the sequence shows the struggles of Tony Stark, who was finding it difficult to deal with post-traumatic stress disorder. This movie was released after the first Avenger movie, so it was directly related to it. He faces a new enemy, a terrorist known as the Mandarin, who is wreaking havoc across the U.S. with a series of explosive attacks. As Stark investigates the bombings, he discovers that the Mandarin is not who he seems and must use all of his resources to stop him and save his loved ones. As a result, the Iron Man movie trilogy became the most successful individual superhero movie, grossing about $2.4 billion worldwide. The latest rumors have it that the Maverick star Tom Cruise could be seen as an alternate Tony Stark in the fourth installation of the movie. These speculations started floating after a fan-made trailer of Iron Man 4 went viral. The jaw-dropping video perfectly fits Tom Cruise as the latest replacement of Robert Downey Jr. This has made the internet go crazy over the fact that Tom Cruise is finally a worthy competitor of playing Iron Man, other than Robert Downey Jr. These rumors might turn out to be true, as earlier it was speculated that Tom Cruise will play a part in Doctor Strange The Multiverse of Madness. Although it was said that Tom only had a small cameo in the Doctor Strange movie, the makers cut it out. This has made the internet go crazy expecting Tom Cruise as the next Iron Man. The makers have not confirmed anything about it, but we are yet to see. Do you think Tom Cruise could be the perfect replacement to play Tony Stark? Do let us know your thoughts in the comment down below and give this video a huge thumbs up if you liked it.